So as I was saying before my camera rudely stopped recording on me, um, they were starting to take pictures and I was like, no, wait, I can't see. So I literally grabbed my shirt and wiped the tears out of my eyes and everybody started laughing and then we took some pictures and um, then TJ came over to me and I, uh, he said, you know, um, remember how T, uh, remember how Hodgins, um, had an anger management problem back in season one, too? And I was like, yeah. He was like, well, I want you to have this. Um, this is one of his, well, my original, um, rubber bands that I used in the first couple seasons. Um, and he handed me a green rubber band that he had been wearing, um, which I didn't know he was wearing, but he gave it to me, and I was like, um... You know, that, yeah, uh, he was like, you know, that Angie gave to him, um, back in season one and two. Angie, well, Angela is his wife, um, on the show. And I was like, oh my god, thank you. Like, you didn't have to do that. But he was very sweet and gave it to me. And then I asked him, you know, can I get my proper hug now? And he just hugged me from the side because, um, he wasn't getting out of his chair at the time. So, yeah, and then we left and we went back to the hotel. Oh, yeah, I didn't mention that, um, I forgot to mention that they got us a limo and, uh, they drove us in the limo and, you know, it was amazing. The limo was really cool and it was great. So we got back in the limo and we drove back to the hotel and it was great. Um, and yeah, it was just amazing. And, um, also I was talking to Tamara Taylor earlier in the day and I had told her that, you know, Back at one point, uh, while the show was on, the Stephen Nathan, one of the showrunners at the time, had said he wanted to have one of Brennan's interns be in a chair. And so, you know, I was like, if uh, if you guys are still interested in that storyline, I'm available. And she was like, you need to tell Emily that. Like, that would be awesome. So I did. I told Emily, and she was like, well, Stephen Nathan isn't um, the showrunner right now. And I was like, well, yeah, I know. But if you guys still want to do it, you know, let me know. I'm here. She, she just laughed. She's like, yeah, maybe, but I think now that they've made Hodgins paraplegic, um, I think they've covered that, um, wheelchair, uh, storyline, which I'm kind of happy about that it's one of the originals because, you know, people are more invested in it, in the story, in his storyline and, and what's going to happen, whereas if it was just an intern who was in a chair, uh, I don't think they would care as much, but I'm really happy that they are starting to bring disabilities into, um, TV shows because not many people do. Also, our hotel, which is the Lowe's Hollywood Hotel, or which was the Lowe's Hollywood Hotel, which was absolutely beautiful, and the staff and everyone at the hotel was great. The breakfast and the food was great. Um, was is actually in a show uh, on ABC right now. They actually were filming uh, during the um, during our stay um, called The Catch on ABC which I watch, and it's just absolutely great, but it's so cool to see our hotel on that show. Um, but yeah, the trip was just absolutely amazing, and I feel so, so blessed to have been able to have this, this experience, and to finally, finally be able to share it with you guys, um, because it's been a long, long three months that I've had to keep all of this a secret, um, for legal reasons. Um, I'm trying to think if I'm forgetting anything. I probably am, um, because so much happened, and, um, it was great. Oh, yeah, we got to go to Angela's office as well, and we got to see the Angela Tron up close, which was really fun. Fun fact about that is that the Angela Tron is actually a full-functioning machine. They project all of the, um, the things that are needed for each case up onto the screen, uh, the graphics department does that, and it's great, um, and also with the interrogation room, it's not a double-sided mirror, you know how in each episode, like, Booth and Brennan and, um, are watching from behind the mirror in the early scenes, well, yeah, it's not a double-sided mirror, another fun fact, um, let's see, anything else that I can tell you, <sighs> um, that I'm forgetting, probably, but I can't remember right now, but all I can say is that it was just such an incredible experience, Every from, everyone from the cast and crew, from the cast to the crew, um, to the Fox people, were just some of the nicest people I've ever, ever met, and I feel so blessed, um, so thank you everyone at Bones and Fox, and Make-A-Wish for making this happen, it's truly been a dream come true, 
and uh, it was totally an educational experience that I will never, ever, ever forget. To Emily, TJ, and Tamara, thank you, thank you, oh, and BK as well, thank you, thank you, thank you for being so sweet and so welcoming. Um, you've made me feel like I was part of the Bones family for years, uh, and I couldn't be more grateful and thankful to all of you. Um, oh yeah, I also forgot to mention that um, Michael Lang and Emily Deschanel both invited me back to set <laughs> um, for when they start shooting in July when I go back, because you guys know I'm going to LA for my 21st birthday, so, um, but I just found out yesterday that um, the air date for season 12 of Bones, which is their final season, will not premiere until winter of 2017, so I don't know if they are shooting, starting to shoot again in July, or if they're waiting to start shooting. I have no idea, um, and I'm waiting to hear back from Caitlin, the woman who helped us at Fox, um, but I have been waiting like a month or two now to hear back from her, so... I will be emailing her again in June if I don't hear from her, but I'm keeping my fingers crossed, and I hope you guys do the same for me, um, because I really, 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 really want to go back and hang out with all those cool cats, because they are amazing, and I would just love to spend some more time with them, um, and maybe get, uh, to be an extra in the scene, just throwing out, throwing that out there, though it probably won't happen, <laughs> uh, anyway, um, yeah, so that's it for this kind of story time type video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it, and I'm so sorry that I haven't been uh, uploading in the last couple months. I've missed you guys so much, but I am back now, and um, a weight loss update will be probably the next video I do, um, probably in about a week or so, maybe less. Um, Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed this, and uh, if you're new, hi, my name is Emma. Thank you so much for checking out my video. I appreciate it. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Um, and I will talk to you guys soon. All right, I love you all so much, and I'm so happy to be back. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye! Mwah.